Ei. O cara da imobiliária não aceitou a pintura que eu fiz. Agora eu vou ter que sair, comprar outra tinta e chamar um pintor pra vir aqui pintar. Pra eu conseguir entregar o apartamento. Tentei economizar e paguei o dobro. E foda que tá tudo muito caro. Tá caro ir na esquina. Imagina sair do país. Mas eu vou dar um jeito. Quando você menos esperar, eu vou estar aí. Você vai ver. Você veio mesmo, né, Mati? Eu acho que eu não me permiti te imaginar aqui. Eu já tava aqui, só voltava a chegar. Obrigada. Tem mais, tem mais. Nossa. O cabelo da Mari tá tão bonito nessa foto. São todos muito bonitos. Nossos amigos são muito bonitos. É doido ver a sala, essa casa vazia, assim, essa janela parece que é bem maior. E aqui? Como é que tá? É aqui que eu moro. Essa é a sala. Ali é a cozinha. E no fundo tem os quartos. O quarto. Eita, o que, que aconteceu? Quebrou o copo. Você machucou? Não. Deixa eu te ajudar. Pode deixar. Acostumada.
Minha mãe que me ensinou a arrumar a casa. Ela era muito minuciosa. Fazia tudo muito bem feito, deixava a casa um brinco. E eu bagunçava tudo em menos de uma hora. Quebrava o copo direto. Espalhava tudo. Ela ficava louca. Era um caos. Seu jeitinho, né? Tem coisa que não muda. Não sei se eu já te contei. Uma vez ela ameaçou trocar todos os copos de vidro por copos de plástico. Eu fiquei meio... Meio de cara, mas realmente... A gente ficou uns... Dois anos só usando um copo de plástico azul. Ah, eu não ia ligar de ter uma casa só com um copo de plástico. Pelo menos não quebra. Você filma tudo o tempo todo. <risos> Vem cá. Essa vai ser a minha memória quando eu esquecer de tudo. Tô com tanta saudade de tudo, não ti. Mas eu acho que o que eu sinto mais falta é do sol. Essa chuva deprime. Júlia, foi todo mundo embora. Não tem mais ninguém lá. Não é mais o mesmo lugar. E aqui não é lugar nenhum. Mati, não precisa me esperar pra comer não, viu? Hoje eu vou agarrar aqui. Vou ter que dobrar porque o restaurante lotou e eles não vão chamar mais ninguém. Ficar pra ajudar o pessoal da noite. Devo chegar em casa bem tarde, já meio de madrugada. É, queria ficar com você, mas amanhã a gente passa o dia junto. Ei? Onde você tá indo? Não sei. Você tá bem? Não. 
Você sabe que eu tô feliz que você tá aqui comigo, né? Nath... Não sou eu que tô aqui com você. É você que tá aqui comigo. Eu tô aqui... E é como se eu tivesse desde sempre. Você acabou de chegar. Eu acordo pedindo, desejando que você não tivesse vindo. Para que você não precisasse viver o que eu vi. Essa é minha vida. Todo dia eu acordo e tá cinza. Essa sou eu agora. E eu... Eu te amo. Eu amo quem você é. Eu amo que você tente. Que você se importe. Mas tá... Tá muito difícil pra mim viver aqui. Alô? Ei, tudo bem? Oi, filha. É, você está podendo falar? Tô, mais rápido. É, queria te falar daqui. Já tem um mês. Nossa, isso tudo? É, oi. Você está pensando em ficar quanto tempo aí? Ah, não sei, depende daí, né? Não, não foi. Você tá fazendo drama disso de novo, né? Tem família aqui, não precisa fazer isso. Isso é uma poesia. Essa beldade. Mais importante que ter uma memória é ter uma mesa. Mais importante que já ter amado um dia é ter uma mesa sólida. Uma mesa que é como uma cama de urna com seu coração de árvore, de floresta. É importante em matéria de amor não meter os pés pelas mãos. Mas mais importante é ter uma mesa, porque uma mesa é uma espécie de chão que apoia os que ainda não caíram de vez. Oh! a mesa!
você, nós dois Já temos um passado, meu amor Um violão guardado, aquela flor E outras minhas mais Eu, você, João, girando זכרי, בניגוד לדעה הרווחת, דווקא הבדידות היא משאת הנפש הנשכחת. כל מצוקתו של אדם כולה נובעת מכך שאינו מסוגל לשבת בחדר שקט לבד. שבי בחדר השקט שלך לבד. 
הטלפון מצלצל, אל תזוזי. הישארי במקומך. הוא מצלצל שוב, התעלמי. גם אם ישוב יצלצל שש פעמים, ושבע ושמונה יישארי לשבת. חכי שהשקט ישרור שוב, ויישארי במקומך. הפחד יעלה, הריק ישאב, החשיכה תכביד, אבל את תחזיקי מעמד. חפשי בתוכך את אשר אבד. אם תרצי לחלץ עצמות, קומי. קומי? קומי, לכי אל המראה. מצאי בדמות שבמראה פנים זרות. דעי שזו האישה שאת צריכה להכיר עכשיו. לאט ובהדרגה. בעדינות. זה לא יהיה נעים, האמיני לי. היכנסי למיטה וכסי את גופך בשמיכה. עד מעל למצחך. שלחי רגליים וידיים לצדדים, הרגישי את מוטת כנפייך. הצמידי כל תו בגופך לסדין הקריר. הריחי אותה. זכרי כי תפסה כאן מקום. שמחי ואילזי במרחב הנטוש. התנחמי בדלת התרוקה. אילצי. נגעי בעצמך. כמובן, את זאת לא צריך להזכיר לך. סילדי תמיד מגילויי חיבה. אל תלכי שבי אחר רגשות חמים. היזהרי מלפיתת היופי המאורגן. וכדי שלא תתפתי, לכי למשתלה. קני עציץ של בגוניה. זוהי, את מבחינה היטב, יפעתו של האמצע. הניחי אותה על שולחן הקפה במרפסת. התבונני בה מעת לעת. אשקי אותה במסורה. הבחיני בחסרונות של הזולת. יש כאלו הרבה. לא יקשה עלייך לאתר אותם. אני מרגישה שאני ממש, את יודעת, מוצאת עצמי ומצאה את היכולות שלי, אבל מצד שני גם הייתי רוצה להיות קצת יותר כמוך, ולא יודעת, אני מסתכלת עלייך, ואני מרגישה ש... צעירה מדי. תמיד הייתי ליד, הייתי קרוב, הייתי כמעט, ולא שם. והיום אני כן מרגישה שאני יכולה לבנות משהו עם מישהו. שקוע בהבליה. אני אשמח גם להכיר אותך יותר ולדעת את הדירה שלך מקסימה. את מאוד יפה לדעתי. היא לא קשובה די הצורך לצער העולם. היא מבקשת ממך להקשיב לה, אבל היא לא מקשיבה לעצמה. היא לא שומעת מה היא אומרת. היא אומרת הכל בסדר. המשחק מתנהל בחדווה, אנחנו מעסיקות את עצמנו, הזמן עובר, אנחנו מתקדמות משלב לשלב, אנחנו מהמרות קטנות, כמעט שלא נופלות, לא מסתכנות יתר על המידה, רק אל נא תשכחי לשחק לפי החוקים. אל תשברי לי את הלב, ואני לא אשבור את שלך. את לא תתערבי לי בנשמה שלי, ואני, בתמורה, לא אשחרר את שלך, ולא אפיץ אותה לכל הרוחות, והיא לא תתפוגג. בואי, נשחק ביחד. טוב?
מדי פעם, וזו משימה לא נעימה, אבל הכרחית, התאכזרי לנפש חיה, כרמי כאב. הסתאבי, וחזרי בריצה לחיק בדידותך הנקייה. לדוגמה, הילדה הזאת שנושאת עיניה אלייך ומבקשת ללמוד בך וממך את רזי התשוקה. הילדה הזאת שמחייכת אלייך בשמחה גלויה, מוטפת, עטופה. היא הבחי אותה על בטנה. שכבי עליה. נשקי את עורפה. נשקי את ישבנה. הכניסי יד בין הירכיים שלה והיכנסי בתוכה. אני חילה להרדם, אבל אעירי אותה באמצע הלילה. אמרי לה, את לא יכולה לישון כאן, מותק. לכי הביתה. המונית כבר מחכה. זכרי, מה שאת רואה הוא כל מה שיש. שום דבר טוב או רע או מפלצתי או מהמם או מעליב או מעציב או קרוע וסדוק ותלוש לא יצמח מהבגוניה הזאת חוץ ממנה עצמה. וגם זאת במידה ידועה. גחכי לעצמך. מדי פעם שחררי את רצועת מחשבותייך ואניחי להן להתרחק. אל תדאגי, הן יסתדרו שם בחוץ. אבל כמובן, אפשר שמחשבותייך דווקא ירוצו בחשקוש זנב, כמו לפקודתך, הישר אל המיטה של ליל אמש. במקרה כזה, שירקי להן מיד למחשבותייך הסוררות. קראי להן לשוב אלייך, מיד. רגל, ארצה, אל רביצת הבהייה הריקה. העלי בדמיונך את הדברים היפים בעינייך, ושימי לב, כמעט אף פעם הם אינם בני אדם. אורבנית חול כנף, בניין לבן רחב בולט אל הרחוב, כמו קרנף לבן שועט, אצבעות ידייך שלך, הכלב של השכנים. ספינה ונהר עוברים בלב העיר ויוצאים ממנה לבלי שוב. שושנת מים כחולה, בברכה ירוקה. הם אינם בני אדם. שכבי פרקדן ונגעי בעצמך. העדיפי תמיד את מגע אצבעותייך. הניחי שרק את מכירה את גופך.
אמרד את החשיכה, צאי מן הבית. הקפידי לא לדבר עם הבריות. לכי הישר אל הרחוב שלה היורד אל הים. יצרי על המדרכה מול דלת ביתה. אל תעזבי עד שלא תראי אותה בשגרתה הנינוחה. יעבור שעה, יעברו שעות. הנה, מי זו שבאה אליה? גם אם אינה באה, את תביאי אותה. הדלת נפתחת, היא עומדת על המפתן, ניגשת אל האורחת, מניחה יד על מותנה, מנשקת אותה בשפתיה. הנשיקה נמשכת והולכת ואת אינך הולכת. את נשארת לראותה עד שהיא נגמרת מאחורי דלת סגורה. נשארי לעמוד מן העבר האחר של הרחוב. אל תחצי אותו. אל תבואי אליה ואל תצלצלי בפעמון. אל תדפקי בדלת. אל תזוזי. אל תקימי צעקות ואל תקראי לה עד שהיא תפתח לך. חיוורת, רדומה, ותשאל אותך מה את עושה. אל תדחפי אותה פנימה, אל תגידי שאת מצטערת, אל תבכי, אל תאבדי שליטה, אל תבקשי שתקשיב לך עד הסוף ותיתן לך להסביר. וזה ברור, אל תגידי שאת לא יכולה בלעדיה. חשוב מאוד לא להתבלבל, לא להתחנן, לא לבקש הזדמנות שנייה, אל תגידי לה שאת מצטערת. על הצער אין לומר דבר. תנסי אל המים, שיתפי את עצמך כמו שאת, התענגי על המלח, הניחי יד על החזה, נשמי עמוק, חשבי על הדברים היפים בעינייך, אצבעות ידייך, שושנת מים כחולה בברכה ירוקה.
I didn't see you, I didn't see you walk, walk in. So, is this a macchiato or a, <clears throat> a latte kind of night? Uh, macchiato to go. Okay. Um, oh, can I, can I actually see that? You have, you need to, uh... You should get that fixed. Stop worrying about my holes. Um, hey, are you sure you want that to go? Just... She's here late tonight. Yeah, I've given her like three refills already. All right, make it for here. French fries with hot sauce and I'll take care of hers. Yeah, um, right, okay. okay. Okay, so I'm getting the cheese kind of sad tonight, right? Okay, it's the eyes. Maybe. You have, you have, you're so great at what you do, and I think you should know that. You know, I just... Shit. Damn, Jet. Uh, that's okay. As much as I appreciate this image, I can, I can do it. I'm such a flavorful badass. <laughs> Thank you. Of blood on your shoes. What did you say? There's blood on your shoes. Uh, yeah. Uh, I should. I should go clean it off. <laughs> Weird. 
You forgot this. Why do you have hundreds of pictures of me? My hands, my face, I, I don't even know. <laughs> my name. I don't remember my name. What's your name? Jet. Jet. Like a plane? Yeah, like a plane. That's your given name? Does it matter? So what's my name? That I don't know. Then why the fuck are you drawing me? <laughs> You're really good at sitting still. <laughs> For how long? Five years. I'm, I meant like in hours? Five years? You've been drawing me every day for five years? <laughs> every day? <laughs> well, some nights I, I had to work late, so I couldn't always come in. So every other day? <laughs> you really don't know my name? <laughs> I wish I did. I wondered. Sometimes I, I made up names. Here, let me show you. Jada. <laughs> Amelie. What do you want to call me today? How about Diana? <laughs> Can I at least walk you home or something? You assume I know where that is. Do you want to stay with me until you figure some things out? Diana says yes. It's yours. I'm going to go uh, get my stuff and see what I left behind, and then we can go, OK? Sure.
This isn't very proper. Well, well, they do need cleaning as well. Actually, they need cleaning the most. Suspecting more of you, underwear style wise. Hey, Dan. Boxers or briefs? If you have to ask, then you just don't get it, darling. <laughs> Remember at uni when we got home that time? Is it Josh? What was he wearing? Was it like a thong or something at that point? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I can't erase that from my memory, can I? <laughs> God. That was the worst thing to ever happen to me. <sighs> what? Worse than getting caught in the lift that time? Oh, my God. <laughs> that has got to be top five for sure. How is that not your number one? Oh, don't even get me started. Oh, really? Honestly. What, your first kiss? Oh, that was Steve Pentagast. We held hands while walking home and I thought I was going to have a heart attack. <laughs> I kissed him on his dad's car. <laughs> I seem to recall a story about your chosen one. Stacy, was it? Oh, Tracy. Green. Sleepover. Had a retainer in. Ew. She wasn't actually that bad considering particularly when she went down there. You get it. <laughs> Mine was uh, Graham Jones, and he was awful, and I was terrified because he had braces. Yeah. Shut up. Yeah. Oh, oh, no, God, no. Just, oh, oh, God, yes, yes. Oh, oh no, just, oh, please. <laughs> well, I bet he has perfect teeth now. <laughs> Besides, you're hardly fashionable back then either. I'm always fashionable, thank you. Mm, debatable. Although, I did like your take on boy. Mm, yeah. I really nailed it that night. And not just the costume. Ugh, God, I don't even want to know. Who was that? No, no, no. Anyway, the <laughs> outfit was great. Oh, thank you. <clears throat> what about me? You did your best. <laughs> Calm down, Anna Winter. That look was iconic. Oh, come on, give my sock back. I can't let me walking around with odd socks. Socks don't need to match. Yeah, they do. Mm. I don't know, I think socks can be alone and then that way they can try and find another sock to match with and that's totally cool. I'm sorry, what now? What's wrong? It is. I thought I had a match in the sword. And then I did, and then I did it. And now I can. I don't know. You are better off without the, that salt. You know that. Come on, we'll talk this through. That just wasn't a good match. I know. I know, but... It's not even a bit hurt anymore. I can't even find... Like another sock I like. I date the other day when alright. <sighs> she was boring. She had two drum. No. She just <sighs> I don't know, we shouldn't even match in the first place. <sighs> and then I got too drunk. 
Well, you don't want to be with someone who doesn't love you. You don't want to be with someone who doesn't understand you. Guys, it's just shit. Right now. It's for the best, right? I don't know. Hmm. Come on. <laughs> Where is that strap-on wearing <laughs> Elton John icon who broke Tracy Green's heart, eh? <laughs> you were here before her, and you're here after her, and you're going to be here for the next one. Ugh. How bad is it? <laughs> I'd say you don't. <laughs> Come on. You clearly need company tonight, and I'm hungry, so... Dinner and a movie? My treat. Oh. If it's on you, then we're going to an actual cinema, and it's the one closest to my house this time. No wish is my command. Right, clear yourself up. There's tissues in there. <laughs> where, where, where? <laughs> this has got to go in your top five. <laughs> Rory is a lucky boy. <laughs> that is a birthday present, not meant for your eyes. <laughs> Give that back. I'm not even kidding. Give it back. Who's the best? Bimini, uh, babes. After them. Fine, you. You. Fine, you're the best. Logical. How you have me feeling grounded but astrological. Tell me why I can feel it in my particles. Like Barry Allen, I'm accelerating while I glow. I'm prodigal. I kind of like you, so I purchased you a pot of gold. Why you looking at me like you see the beautiful? I'm Spike Spiegel, bounty hunter with a lot of dough. I do the most. Алло. Да. Не, сестра ми не ми се излиза. Не, и, и времето е ужасно. Не искам. Не. Добре. Да, ще дойда. Айде.
И после. Ало, сестра ми? Къде си? Шегуваш се, нали? От 20 минути съм тук. Добре. Чао. Леле, супер много се извинявам. Нищо стои. Извинявам се. Ето, ето си и салфетки. Чакай, чакай, защото ти улях и дънките. Извинявам се, не беше нарочно. Искаш ли поне да те почерпи един чай? Извинявай много, наистина. Не, няма нещо. Добре, или да си едеш телефона и така просто да пием нещо за реванш. Добре. Добре. Ало? Елена? Да, да, спомних си от кафенето. Да. Ами... Аз сега ставам и... Не съм... Ами трябва да се... Поправя, ще ми трябва време. Здравей. Здравей. Много си бърза къд за човек, който става тук, що? Аз по принцип съм мокра. Искаш ли да мръдна на някъде, защото на мен малко почва да не става студено? Сега ли? Мога да пием чай някъде, ако искаш. Искаш ли? Добре. Айде. А, от тук. Ти искаш протокал? Не, благодаря. Това е твоето. Разбъркай си го малко. Благодаря, аз не пия. Много си ми е смешно. Добре, нали видя, че до сега правих това, защо не ми каза по-рано? Извинявай, го глеждах просто. Айде ще го пробваш обаче. Не, наистина не ми се пия в момента. Наистина, пробвай го, моля те. После. Айде, не, със се малко пробвай, не е толкова холко холко. Ще го пробва, мърси. Ора, трябва да значиш малко по-често да казваш да. И аз я доразплети.
е много си красива, така много по-хубава. Аз обаче забравих, че имаме много говорка с сестра ми и трябва да тръгвам. Чао. Uh, Елена, здравей! Uh, как си? Uh, излиза ли ти се някъде? Аз uh, днес съм свободна. А, не си в България. Uh, добре. Uh, ми... Ако искаш, като се превереш, ми звъни. Uh, би било приятно. Да. Няма да се Какво си намери? Много е яка. Но ми харесва. Так път толкова. И виж колко е стара. Чакай само да видим нещо. Какво правиш, бе? Нещо ти поправиш. Остави я, моля те. Да. Ще ни хване, моля да оставя. Моля да оставя.
Не мало языка. Как Вземаш ли другия път с теб? Много ясно. Так че?
Хелс, сестра ми? Искаш ли да излезем?